Hey guys, what's up? This is the final episode of the season for Hunger Games. I hope you're excited. So what's going to be going on is first, everyone's going to meet up at this beach. Then they are going to have to swim to this beach. Once they get to this beach, if they haven't died yet, they will have to um, fly around in a jetpack for either three or five hours. I haven't decided yet. Uh, and if they don't die from that, then I'm still thinking of the next step because maybe vending machine. I, I really like the vending machine deaths. So I might do that. I'm not sure. Or the bed, the Murphy bed. We'll see. One of those. But I think they've all gotten to the beach, have they? Oh, they're getting there. Who's missing? Oh, no, they're all there. Nice. All right. Can they all swim here? Oops, not fish. Wait, wait, hold up. Swim. And swim. All right, everyone will be swimming now. I just want to make sure they could get in. Why are, all right, they're just changing. So, it doesn't really, I guess it doesn't really matter who um, starts swimming first. Because they all have to make it here anyways. All right, let's swim here. Swim. Swim. I keep forgetting it's extreme swim for that asshole. Alright. Now, I want to make sure they're actually going to swim the length and not get out of this. And You jerks better not get out. Alright, good. Good. They're swimming there. That's what I like to see. They're going to, like, swim to one of the taxi boats and just ride there. Alfred's a little close to the edge. I'm worried he's gonna like, you know, try to go back to land and take a cab there. Ooh, that's nice. Lovely scene during the Hunger Games. Look at this floating building. I'd live there. I would definitely live there. No one could bother you. You couldn't get any weird people at your uh, door because they couldn't get there. They would have to fly. So I guess at least they get this cool sight before they die. <laughs> If you want to look on the bright side. And one of them will survive. So that's good. Alright, let's speed things up now. How are there? It's Petto's birthday. Oh my god. Um, Alright, hunger. Uh, uh, oh, Alfred doesn't have a lot of energy, does he? Alfred, you cheating fuck! Alfred! <laughs> He's so used to being a corrupt cop that he's trying to be corrupt in The Sims Hunger Games. Did anyone else do this? Look at... No, Pedo Bear is actually doing the challenge. Oh, wait. No, not go home. What did I do? What have I done? It's okay. Where's the... um? Where is the beach they're going to? It's over here. Yeah, there it is. I don't know how I just missed that. All right. No, you swim here. All right. And was Ethan going to cheat? No, he wasn't. Damn it, Alfred. Where did Alfred get off at? Right here? Look, like, what are you doing? I think he's still going to swim, though. I think he's... I don't actually know what he's going to... Let's, let's just see what he does. I'm curious. I'm really curious now because I honestly he's we'll make sure he swims, but I don't think he's gonna last that long. In fact, I think he was just here though. Like he, I think this is where he got out for some reason. Well, whatever. Alfred, you have to swim over here. If you want to win, you have to do this. Don't try to get out of it again. Or we're just going to kill you. Don't you dare. He's... What is he doing? What? Did he... What? I think there was something weird happened there. Alright. No. Alright. He's going. Thank you. Oh my god. Alright. Where are the other two? Petalware's going to make it. Oh no he's not. Someone is about to die. 
I swear. I think Ethan might actually win. He's been like the most quiet this entire season. Uh, he's really low on energy though. Alright, they've made it. They've made it. So you guys can get out. I can't believe they made it. Nice. Oh, Ethan did have energy. What? Did he like... I don't know. Okay. So they'll just uh, await for Alfred. Ugh, they could start... I feel bad making them wait. But... Are you serious? Are you serious with this shit, Alfred? Are you serious? Nope. Absolutely not. Get back in the ocean. I swear. They're gonna start... You know what? I've decided they're gonna start without Alfred. Why are they going back in the water? I have to closely watch you, Alfred. You're pissing me off. I think he swam back just to get off the beach. No, don't go home. Don't swim. Why are they swimming? Why was this a good idea to them when they're that tired? Oh my god. Alright, now let's uh, buy in the slots so we can give them the jetpacks. Alright, I'm going to put three jetpacks. I think we'll only need two. I don't think Alfred's going to make it. Alfred, I swear, no. Oh, shit, no. Damn it, Alfred. <laughs> this, is, this is seriously happening. I'm just gonna, you know what? I'm just going to make him swim in a bunch of random spots so that he has to keep doing it. He's, like, repeatedly saying no. All right, where's Petto Bear? I accidentally made him swim. No, do not swim. If you're smart, you won't swim. All right, Alfred, I'm keeping my eye on you. Can Sims like not drown in the ocean? Because I feel like you would drown <laughs> at this point. Like, I really feel like you would drown. And why, what are you doing? No, no, no. I'm gonna kill all of these Sims. Alfred. Did I see that? Did I seriously see that? <sighs> Let's just get to the jetpack thing. I feel like we need to. Alright, fly around, Alfred. And then no one else has a jetpack, so we'll have to wait to get them theirs. But Alfred can do his challenge now. Petto Bear and Ethan can go home, because they actually did the swimming challenge. And what's with these random people going into the ocean at night? <laughs> so weird. All right, nope, you're not done. Fly around. It's too tight. Oh, there's enough open space? What? Don't lie to me. Oh my god, you're aging up? Really? <laughs> we can't get anyone to do anything. They're being... This is like, for some reason, a huge pain. All right, you can finally fly around again. He's flown around three times now. So I think one more time... And then we'll have everyone else. Uh, we'll do three times each. All right, Petto Bear. You need to go home. Everyone should go home so we can actually get them a jetpack. Alfred was the only one who actually had his jetpack already. We couldn't get the ones on the lot that I had put there. Jetpack. Fly around. Yes, there is enough open space. Let's get over it. There so is. All right, go. He's pretty good. Now, can he do that three more times? All right, looks like Ethan is going to make it through this. Now, Petto Bear, you have to do it. One of them's going to starve to death soon, too. They're all pretty equal there, actually. All right. Fly around. All right, two more times. All right, and once more. All right, now we're next. We're gonna do the vending machines. Someone will definitely has yeah. Someone has to die with the vending machines. 
Oh great, they're gonna do the stupid jetpack thing. How is that not fixed yet? <laughs> it's like the most annoying thing. Alright, let's speed this up a touch. Pedal Bear, are you being difficult? Damn it, Sims! I'm gonna kill them all! Every time they stop, they're gonna have to do it eight more times. I've just decided. Alright, actually, Alfred, since you kept your things, I'll let that slide. Pedal Bear, like, canceled all of them. Oh, Alfred, no. This guy's like, what are you guys doing? Alright, Pedal Bear, that means one more. Well, actually, Pedal Bear, you have three more. You shouldn't do them. They're still in your stupid thing. Oh, and that's it for you! Oh, man. Well, he had to do all his vending machines. <laughs> Goodbye, Pedo Bear. Oh, it's Ethan's birthday. Will he win the Hunger Games? Alright, so what's next, man? Should we just do the jelly bean? Should we do a swim off? We've done like all a lot of the challenges at least. Maybe we should let them sleep for a bit. Alright, let's try the Murphy bed too. Alright, Alfred's done that once. That bed is too dangerous to use. No, it is not. Do it again. Alright, we'll just have them both open and close this until someone dies. Alright, one more time each, and I think we're gonna have to move on to something else. All right, looks like they both made it through. Actually, Alfred, you have to get yours up. Please. We might have to do the jelly beans, you guys. I feel like they, you know, they've done so many challenges this episode. It's kind of like, I like that they made it through all of those, except Alfred and the fucking swimming thing. He deserves to die. He really does for that. All right, they'll just do this. Eight times each. All right. Is either one of them gonna die? Oh no, not Alfred! He's sleeping in a fire! Oh, well, he saved himself, nice. No, Alfred, why are you doing the bed? You gotta do this one more time. Oh wait, no, that was Ethan. Sorry, Ethan. You, Alfred. All right, neither one of them died from the jelly bean. All right, we're gonna have them do the pool. Cause there's like, that's certain death. That is certain death. All right. Let's see who's gonna eat it first. That is it. <laughs> I mean, they both have no energy. So. Oh, Ethan, is he going? No, it cannot be Alfred. <laughs> Damn it, Alfred. Corrupt as always. He manages to win. Just like he does on Kelly's police brigade. Uh, I was team Alfred, though, so I'm actually pretty happy. <laughs> um, I'll reset him. Um, and we don't need to reset him. It'll be fine. <laughs> I'll just pause the game. I hope you guys enjoyed that season of the Hunger Games. It was all right. I feel like they their house was too far away from like where most of the uh, activities are. So at times it could be kind of boring. Like nothing was going on around them. It was just them in the house, which I don't know. It's not as good. You need like neighbors to come poking around because weird stuff happens. And uh, yeah, I can't wait for the next season. I always love starting a new season of the Hunger Games. And uh can expect that in about a week a week and a half take us a little longer to do the first episode and plan everything so hope you guys have a great day bye